I'm Nick Chen, and I am a researcher here at MSR Cambridge. And the project I'm showing today is a project called Rich Review. And uh, what Rich Review is, is a system to make, uh, to make asynchronous collaboration more efficient. Uh, so when people work together, they can often work synchronously, so together in real time. So for example, if they're working together in Office 365 or Google Docs all at the same time, or they can work asynchronously. So um, in this case, it'd be one person working on a document, handing it off to a collaborator. The collaborator would make some comments, review it, and send it back to uh, the original author. So this is, the latter is the type of activity we're trying to support with Rich Review. With uh, existing tools, for example, things like Microsoft Word comments or track changes, uh, generally the annotations uh, and the information that can be exchanged uh, in this asynchronous collaboration process is quite limited and limited only to text. With Rich Review, we wanted to take advantage of the unique sensing capabilities of contemporary tablet devices to allow people to create richer, more expressive annotations. So probably the best way to show this is a demo of the Rich Review system uh, in action. So this is the Rich Review app, and it basically supports standard uh, uh, PDF viewing capabilities. For example, the ability to uh, ink directly on the document. But in addition to standard inking, a simple ink gesture starts a rich annotation. And at this point, I can start talking about the document. And with, while I'm talking about it, I can not only, it's not only capturing my voice, but also capturing any hand gestures I'm making on this document so I can zoom into a particular picture and start talking about it. And it's very clear that I'm talking about this picture. I'm also able to hover my pen over a specific location to uh, indicate areas of interest to my collaborator. I can also uh, write while speaking. And my collaborator would see something uh, like this. Starts a rich annotation. And at this point, I can start talking about the document. And with, while I'm talking about it, I can not only, it's not only capturing my voice, but also capturing any hand gestures I'm making on this document. So I can zoom into a particular picture and start talking about it. And it's very clear that I'm talking about this picture. I'm also able to hover my pen over a specific location to uh, indicate areas of interest to my collaborator. I can also uh, write while speaking. So one of the big challenges we face with a rich review is not only making it easy for people to create annotations, but making it easy for recipients of these annotations to consume them. Uh, one of the big challenges with uh, audio annotations is that audio annotations can be somewhat opaque. Uh, it's very difficult for the recipient to understand what's inside the audio annotation, uh, unlike, uh, say, a, text anno a textual annotation where they can quickly skim through the text. One way to solve this problem is we put the audio in the system through a speech-to-text uh, transcriber. And so this audio annotation can be turned into a textual transcript uh, that the recipient can more easily skim and also use the transcript to, uh, for example, jump into a specific location in the annotation. So for example, here we've overlaid the, this transcription over the waveform. We can change it to uh, a pure text version, and we can jump. Clear that I'm talking about this picture. We can jump into a specific location in the in the annotation. A specific location to uh, indicate areas of interest. So the broader kind of overview of this rich review system is that we're really trying to see how introducing the new capabilities of a tablet can enhance the collaboration process across documents.